I'm Michael John Gray, Chairman of the Democratic Party of Arkansas. Arkansans have a rich history. There really is a great deal for us to take pride in. Throughout our state's great moments and crises, time and time again we have seen great leaders emerge. These are people we should celebrate, who have shown us that good can break through even when it appears that we are in the wilderness. It shows us that faith can get a long way. That's why we celebrate Black History Month in February. That's why we are paying attention to our history. It's a time to be inspired. It's a time to stand firm in our resolve. But it's also a time to enjoy the great accomplishments of our state. Too often we think of African American history as just a struggle. But it's not just that. It's a story of victory. It's a story of overcoming. Our history certainly has its dark moments, but that's not who we are. It's not what defines us. What defines us is the moments where the light has broken through. And time and time again, we have seen powerful lights in Arkansas history, prophetic lights in Arkansas history. That's why we talk about Black History Month, and that's why we celebrate it. We celebrate people like Edith Jones, the first African-American to be accepted at a medical school anywhere in the South. She graduated from the University of Arkansas Medical School. We celebrate people like Silas Hunt, a World War II veteran who in 1948 became the first black student admitted to any all-white university in the South since Reconstruction. He was admitted to the University of Arkansas's law school. We celebrate the men and women who entered the legal world and made this state better for all of us. People like Scipio Jones, born the son of a slave, defended black sharecroppers after the Elaine Massacre of 1919, what is still known as the deadliest lynching in U.S. history. We celebrate the hard things and the difficult things that our state has endured. We also celebrate the good, the joy that people have brought this state. People like composer Scott Joplin of Texarkana, who became the father of ragtime music. Those people fill our rich history and give us much to be proud about. These are just a few examples and a few of the people, but we can also rest assured that the heroes of our state are countless. We all live with our history and we can all take a role in shaping it. Black History Month shows Arkansas at its best. It shows the tremendous strides we can take no matter the circumstances. And it shows us that the seemingly improbable is often more feasible than we think. I have faith that we will honor these legacies in our state. I also have faith that we will expect more of our state in the future. And I have faith that our generation will leave a strong legacy for our future generations and for the future of the history of Arkansas. Please join me this February in celebrating Black History Month. I'm Michael John Gray, Chairman of the Democratic Party of Arkansas.